like to thank John and Becky for asking me to be remotely part of your lovely day of music. I'm not the best person at looking into a camera and getting my thoughts together because my thoughts change every second. Lockdown was forced upon us. We were touring in the UK and we had tours cancelled on us. We had to get back to France and we actually arrived in France the day that France announced the lockdown. I've been a touring musician all of my life and that's sort of what I'm good at. What happened here with what I call a mandatory gift of time was that my thought processes changed and I had to ask myself certain questions about what music I wanted to make, why I wanted to make it, should I reflect in the music these times or should I write tunes, should I write songs, should I actually compose music and write music and record it and not just play something or improvise or whatever. So lots and lots of questions. The bottom line for me is that I've enjoyed this gift of time and I don't think I've ever been so relaxed. I'm looking forward hugely to playing again and uh, interacting with other musicians. Um, I've been on the road for a long time and as I say, that's what I'm good at. When we bought this house, we, we've done most of the filming and I think we have 20 minutes or two minutes, I can't remember. It depends on the editing. But when we bought this house, there was one feature, there was one feature we just had to buy the house. There is a maze and both Deborah, my wife and myself are frightened to enter it because it is so complex. It's based on a very famous maze, I can't remember. But once you go in there, you will never find your way out. And I'm going to show you. So this is the entrance. If anybody wants to go in there, you're, I'm not going anywhere near it. If anyone wants to go in there, you're very welcome. But look, isn't that incredible? When we first got back to France, we arrived back in France um, and France announced lockdown on the day that we got back. I suppose the first couple of weeks were quite strange. All the work had gone, so our minds were adjusting to that and the disappointment. But France put into practice uh, quite strict regulations about going anywhere. You had, you had to print off a piece of paper, you had to put the time on the paper, your address, why you were going out. The restrictions here were quite extraordinary. And even now, wherever you go, I don't know what it's like in the UK, because we haven't been there for six months or whatever it's been, uh, Masks everywhere, gloves, lots of squirty things, washing our hands regularly. So it was a couple of weeks, two, three weeks, I suppose, 
of quite a strange time and everybody taking this virus seriously. What happened then to me was that I started enjoying the time off. I've been asked a few questions and one of them was whether this lockdown situation has stifled my creativity or whether ideas are bubbling away and the results of those ideas will, um, will come out in, in some future time. I think it's the latter. I go into my studio every day currently working on tunes for a new album for me and Squeezy John. But I do have ideas. I think a dream of mine has been not just to improvise music and record it, or not just to write a tune that suits a particular thing. Um, I would actually write, like to compose a piece of music, to write it out, to play it, to arrange it. Um, and I've never had the time to do that. I'm going to show you my studio briefly. I shall open the door and looking. This is where things get messy. This is my sanctuary, both true. And this is the studio. Um, all of my microphones and stands are on the ceiling. That way I can keep the floor clear, which is very good. Uh, this one swivels round. I can write songs, sing songs, record, piano, da 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 da. It's very good. And when the music isn't going so well and I need a break, I practiced darts because I'd always wanted to be either a professional golfer or a professional darts player. Oh, miles out. Yes. Okay, so this is our um, vegetable plot. Lots of people say they've got too many courgettes, um, but there's a great recipe which is actually for Swiss chard, which is olive oil, chopped garlic, um, cook the garlic for a little while, but don't burn it or anything, just sort of boil it in the oil. Uh, chili flakes, put the courgettes in cut lengthways and until they cook through. Bit of salt, bit of pepper, beautiful. Oh, I forgot something, lemon zest. Um, so you peel the lemon rind and you cut that up small as well. That goes in at the beginning with the garlic. Absolutely beautiful.
very pleased that I've had that that time creatively I don't know whether I'm in a better or worse place than I've ever been I've never found it um, easy to pick up the violin and play something that satisfies me where I can say that's really good I've written a few good songs um, I want more I want more. And I think that this time off has sown that seed. Uh, before I kick the proverbial, proverbial bucket, I'll drink to that little slip of the word. You're very good health, everyone. Give me a minute. I would like to leave behind, not so much that, I would like to feel that I have created something that has drawn on all of my strengths. Um, and to do that, I need time. The seeds are sown. Okay, I've uh, had a request to sing a song. The request comes from Becky Folk East. Uh, this is a song I wrote a few years ago, and it's called From a Lullaby Kiss.
This day, this day is mine It's mine to keep until tomorrow If my heart is full of joy or sorrow Whether I pay my way or I beg, steal and borrow One thing I know is This day, this day is mine This day, this day is mine It's mine to live without rules to bind me I can close every door so that no one will find me Or I can open my heart and say love come and blind me But one thing I know is This day, this day is mine As I live out my life there's some lessons I've learned If you jump in the fire you're bound to get burned I could say I was pushed in but I was to blame I was drawn to the light and the dance of the flame I was easily led both my heart and my head and believed every word that those dream pushers said because nobody told me the truth about lies that they hide in the words but they live in the eyes this life, this life is mine From a lullaby kiss and my first awaking It's a life I will miss when it's time for the taking Which is why every day must be mine for the making One thing I know One thing I know is This life, this life is mine fruition. Okay, take 476. Mm -hmm. Don't look at you. Don't look at Saul. Two, one, two. One, two, one, two. Are you throwing your arms up? Well, this is me talking. Hello, hello, hello. This is me talking. Volume, volume. This is me talking. Hello, hello, hello. This is me talking. Just lost my way with that. <laughs> Here we go then. Here we go. Great blue theme. And I love spaghetti squash. What? <laughs>